If you are having graphical issues with Diablo 4, perhaps it's giving you an error message when trying to launch the game, saying that you don't have the latest driver installed, or maybe when you actually get into game, the textures aren't loading correctly, everything looks blurry, or you just get a black screen, then don't worry, because in this video I'll be showing you three things that you can do that will resolve this issue. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is click on the link that's in the description below and that will then take you to our website. Once you're on our website, you will see a page that says Easy Gaming Utility. You need to go all the way to the bottom of the page and you will now see a few different options to download the program. So you've got a portable version here or you can go ahead and install it to your computer. For this video, I'm just going to use the portable version, so I'm going to select download now. You can also get it from the Microsoft Store if you prefer. So now that I've downloaded the portable version, I need to open up the .exe. You then need to go ahead and click on OK if you're happy with what the message says. And you will then have a window that looks like this. OK, so we need to scroll all the way to the bottom. And the first thing you're going to want to do is clear the cache files for your graphics card. So I've got an NVIDIA graphics card, so I need to click on the clean button next to NVIDIA. If you have an AMD graphics card or an Intel, then obviously click the button next to those. So once you've clicked on clean, you then need to click on OK, and that's now cleared all the cache files. So you can see there, there's a big list of all the files that have been deleted. So once you've done that, click close, and now go ahead and launch Diablo 4 again and see if that resolved the issue as the cache files can sometimes cause many problems when it comes to games and programs within Windows not working correctly. If that didn't resolve the issue, then the next thing you want to do is open up EGU again, and you then need to click on Game Files. You then need to go to Diablo 4, and you now need to click on Config Files. This is going to open up the location where the config file is located for Diablo. If you prefer not to use the program, then you can always navigate to the location by going to your documents folder, then opening up the Diablo 4 folder. So you now need to right click on this file here that says local prefs. You then need to go rename and we're now going to add BK to the end of the file. Once you've done that, press enter on your keyboard. Also, when it comes to clearing the cache files, if you don't want to use the program, then I will also post some links in the description below to some guides that I've done on how you can do it manually as well. So once you've renamed this file, go ahead and launch Diablo 4 and see if that resolved the issue. If it didn't, then you can delete the new file that gets created and then just simply rename this file back and that will restore your graphics settings. So the next thing you're going to want to do is update your graphics card driver. So if you're not sure what graphics card you have, then you can right click on the start menu icon and go to device manager. Even though you should know what graphics card you have because you wouldn't have been able to do the first step, but just in case you can expand display adapters and you will then see your graphics card here. So you can see I've got an NVIDIA graphics card, which means I need to go to the NVIDIA website and download the latest driver. So I will show you how to do this for an AMD and NVIDIA. So you need to click on one of the links in the description below to your graphics card. So NVIDIA, here you can see you need to select your product type. You then need to select your series. So I've got a 16, so I'll select 16. And then you can see there I've got 1660 Super and I'm using Windows 10 64 bit. So I'll then click on search and I'll then click download and then run the setup file and follow the steps to install the driver. For AMD, again, very similar. Just select graphics and then select your graphics card. Select it again and then select your graphics card and go submit. And you then need to expand the option for Windows that you have. So I've got Windows 10 and you then need to go download and then follow the steps again to install the latest driver. So that is it. That is how you can resolve graphics issues with Diablo 4. So the first thing that you need to do is clear the cache files for your graphics card. The second thing was to rename the config file and then the third was to update your graphics card driver. So I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed the video. If you liked the video, click the like button below and if you want to see more computer sluggish videos, then click the subscribe button.